Hey everybody, a uh, quick tip of the week. So behind me we've got a, a media wall that has some organic garland for a, a football game coming up tonight. Um, what I need to do is I want to get the, um, the, the last football just down in this corner over here. So there's rigging points behind, but there was nothing, nothing just there as you can see. So what I've done is I've tied this tennis around. So I've tied this little um, three balloons, as you can see just here. Um, I've tied them with a piece of nylon. So it's actually hanging from what I do have existing, which is the garland, and that's being tied up by um, some fishing line up and over. Okay, so that part's fine. But to get my rigging point just here for the football, so I've just tied a little cluster such that it's this one white balloon is quite thick and it won't pull back because it's uh, been compressed by the width of the wall and the media wall. So it's hanging by my nylon, so it's dropping to the point which is just here in which I want to tie my football to. And the football is, just got my 260Q with um, stretchy balloon tape. So I'll be able to then tie that just here and I'll show you a photo when it's done. All right, took two seconds, but I, had, I needed two hands <laughs> to do it. So let's just swap around. So here we are, this is our media wall. And you can see the football just here. So I never want to use adhesives, especially on a, a media wall that's being reused. So you can see here, I've got that cluster of three that's being pushed back so it can't come forward beyond the media wall, but it's set in place, it's dropped, it's fallen, and it's being held vertically by that one piece of nylon. So the football itself is just being pushed back into that little three balloons. So here we go. Just sets it quite well. Um, it's a bit more natural where it's not perhaps being compressed against the garland. And we've got balance of the balls right and left.